Your back to school week takes on new meaning today as students in the Plum School District head to class today. That means school buses are rolling this morning and every day more and more will join you out on the road. So new this morning, John Shumway caught a ride with a couple of veteran bus drivers for their behind the wheel view of the challenges on the job. Hey, John, and it was eye opening. I'm Let me sure. just tell you, bus drivers come from every walk of life, but they all go through the same professional training to get behind the wheel. And often their biggest challenges do not come from inside the bus. When COVID hit, Jessica Schwartz was working in a bank. Needed someone, something to do that I could be home with the kids while they were online learning. Now she drives a bus for ABC Transit and sees the same issues with other drivers on the road as 12 year veteran driver Kurt Engelhart. They don't realize that, you know, we, we need a good, we need a little bit of room to maneuver these. And they, they obviously don't stop as fast. Everybody wants to beat the school bus. No one wants to be stuck behind us because we have many stops to pick up. Jessica and Kurt tell me it's the unpredictability of other drivers that keeps them on edge. You learn to get a feel for what people are going to do so that you don't have to make any sudden maneuvers. Because while the inside of the buses are heavily padded, a sudden stop is a major concern. Especially if we're approaching a stop, someone might not have their turn signal on and might stop too short in front of me and the kids are getting their book bags on ready to approach their stop and then the, I stop forward and then the kids could fly right down the aisle. The drivers tell me folks don't understand everything they're dealing with. We have to man the children, man the driving, and also kind of anticipate what other people might do. In other words, they have their hands full with more than just that bus. And they tell me when they turn on their lights to make a stop, it creates a world of responses from the drivers around them. So coming up, we're going to talk about the lights on the bus, what they really mean and what they have seen behind the wheel and how drivers actually should be reacting when those lights start coming on. So you talked about those outside of the bus, other right. drivers, but what yeah. about the kids on the bus? Because <laughs> let's be honest here, sometimes they can be pretty rowdy. Oh, yeah. Yeah, they can, but the drivers tell me actually the students are generally pretty well behaved, although both have the experience of having to pull the bus over, calm everybody down before they would continue on on their ride. You know, it's it could be very distracting with a lot of kids yelling and screaming, I can yeah. imagine. Oh, they easy. are dealing with so much behind Those the Those drivers, wheel. they are saints, that's for sure. It's a tough job. John, thanks.